tease, tease your hair. Volume, girl, get that volume. Volume, okay, not this crazy. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I am going to be showing you guys how to achieve this boho look that I created for Coachella. I will be there weekend one, so I hope to see you guys there. And this is something so easy, and I will also be leaving the link below for uh, the beachy waves that I have on my hair so that you can start off and it takes less than 10 minutes depending on your hair type. So let's get started. Okay, so let's begin. So I already have my hair curled and if you haven't seen the video before, I do have a video of how I achieved my curls using my new me. So I'll leave the description down below. And I filmed this video last week for you guys of how to get these beachy wave curls. So make sure to check that out so that we can do this hair tutorial. So I'm gonna start off by separating my hair with this comb right here that I have. Then it's pointy at the end. So I'm just gonna start by separating it. You can separate it however you want, depending on if you want your hair this way, or if you want it this way, then you would part it this way, or you can also just have it down the middle. For this look, I'm just gonna go ahead and do my hair from here to, from my right to my left. And I'm gonna grab a section. So I want this curl in the front. So I'm just gonna grab a section a little bit near my bangs. So I'm gonna grab this curl here. So you still see I have the front of the hair here. And I'm gonna grab this hair. I'm gonna brush it off real quick. And I'm just gonna go ahead and braid it. So you can go ahead and just separate it you can do a fishtail braid or um, whatever braid you prefer. I honestly don't know how to do a fish braid, so I'm gonna do a normal braid here for you guys. So, and this is something real easy, something that you can do, and you can get a bigger chunk, chunk depending on um, um, how much you want your braid to show. So once we finish doing this braid, once again, obviously every hair type is different. Like I said before in my previous video for my hair, my hair is really thin, so it doesn't take too much time to do my hair. So I'm going to leave a little bit at the end. Okay. So I left about this much of hair. You can leave either more or less. I just want to make sure that it's going to be able to go around. So I'm going to go ahead and grab my scrunchie. Just tie this up together. Just to hold the braid while I do the other hair. So this is Part of the look so far so for this section I'm gonna go ahead and get a just a little bit of this side and as you can see it's a whole section right here so it's a big chunk from here to the front but from here I'm gonna split it in half And I'm only gonna you do the top part, leaving the bottom here. So once again, on this side, you're gonna go ahead and braid it as well. Like I mentioned before, you can go ahead and do a fish braid. I don't know how to do a fish braid. But a regular braid is fine this look as well okay. let me 
can go ahead and leave a small chunk of hair at the end like we did with the other one. So once I have this hair almost about the same length as this as the other one that I showed you guys I'm gonna go ahead and as you can see it's already gonna be a little braid here and we're gonna connect this braid with this braid so we're gonna go ahead and put them towards the back and then we're gonna grab them together you can use a scrunchie or you can use um, a bobby pin whatever it makes it's easier for you For me, I'm going to go ahead and just use this one scrunchie. And this is really good for, for Coachella just because of, I know it's going to be so hot and I will be there weekend one. So this is something easy just to kind of have not so much hair all over your face if you don't really want to be wearing a hat. So really easy to do so now I have my hair and my braids in the back I have this section here because it's what I want and right here just to be make it a little bit more fun I'm gonna go ahead and just have like a little braid here another braid down here just to give it that boho look So here is my braid done here and then I'm just going to grab a small um, scrunchie or you can use like the little rubber bands that they have, you can use one of those and then I'm going to just do one little braid on this side. So far this is what it's looking like. So I'm just going to go ahead. And they also have some colorful um, scrunchies that you can put on your hair. And that would make it so much fun for the festival just because the festival is all about boho and colors. And it's cool if you have like little color popping from your, from your hair, from your scrunchie. Okay, so now we're gonna do the exact same thing on this side. If you wanna get a thicker piece of, of hair, you can to make your braid. It's all up to you. Um, so I'm just gonna make one kind of like in between so you see from my separation here that I did for my bang so this hair I'm gonna go ahead and just split it up in half again and this time I'm gonna do the top part instead of the bottom so that we don't have them so close together but it looks so fun already you have the waves you have the braids I mean, what else would you want for Coachella? So I'm gonna go ahead and braid my hair real quick. Okay, so I'm leaving a chunk of hair at the bottom, like I did before with the other ones. So this is a final look. I hope you guys really enjoyed it. Um, don't forget 
to leave me your comments below as to let me know what other videos you guys want to see. Um, and I will also be leaving the link below of how you guys can get the uh, beach curls that I do. So hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up, subscribe, share with your friends. And if you're going to Coachella, hope to see you there. Besos.